Hi, I'm Robert from LW Flowers. Today we got some assorted Gerbers out of California. Uh, these are sorted large. They come packed 42 to a tray, 84 to two sides. This is how they'll come packed. You can usually get two trays in a box. So they'll staple them in around the edge so they ride better. So the best way I've found to prep them is to just get them out of their trays. Pulling the staples apart here, and we'll get them cut and put in water. Get them removed. Kind of pick up the tray. And that's 40, there'll be 42 Gerberas in the tray. It's easier to just kind of take the tray, hold it upside down. If you can get somebody to help you hold the tray, we'll cut the stems. I really never found a good way to uh, to do these, so this is the way it works for me. Just cut a good inch off the stems so they get a good drink of water. They can tilt them, get them all in the in the bucket. If you don't have any uh, Gerbera containers, I found this is really the best way to keep the stem straight. Give them all a good drink of, of uh, water, keep them in there so their shops can uh, pick them out by color per stem. The, uh, we don't use quick dip in the Gerberas. The growers have told us it's uh, not necessary to use quick dip. It's actually more necessary to keep clean buckets. Um, they don't recommend for or against using any of the crystal clear. I guess the Gerberas really don't look for nutrients more than they need the uh, clean water. So um, we still put nutrients in the, in the bucket. It doesn't, it doesn't hurt them, but uh, quick dipping them is not necessary. Again, that's 42 stems of assorted Gerberas from California and a tray, there's two trays and a half box.